I think there's a lumberjack in here somewhere. Ooh, no, he's not here. Hello and welcome back to another episode of 7 Days to Die Alpha 19. I'm not only 25, aka Mr. Boom. I'm Mr. Boom because we can only use weapons governed by the boomstick perk, absolutely nothing else to engage the zombies. The settings and rules are in the description down below and the playlist if you want to catch up on this series will be in the top pinned comments. Oh yes indeed. Inventory's clear, we're working on a new horde base for the day 63 horde over there, so that's fun. We'll do some more work on that later, hopefully. I'm thinking what we might do is... There's a big old town here we haven't really scratched the surface of, but we haven't spent enough time in the snow biome, in my opinion. So we could just aim for this town over here, then take the bike and drive into the snow, because the snow is hard to see in, would you believe? Just quickly top this off with stone. Beauty. Oh, these are pumping out some nice concrete mix as well for us. Excellent. Let's pick up that motorcycle. Get our gyro pointed in the right direction. Be a good idea. We've got enough gas for this. Let's just go. And if you're interested, level 87, game stage 174, 6343 enemy kills. Game stage 174 though, hello. Right here's the desert town that we're going to be aiming for. We're going to land here and then head over to the snow. We're long overdue a day out in the snow, let me tell you. There we go, we're crossing the boundary from hot to cold. It's a bit silly that the biomes touch, but it's a video game so I can get over it. We can't fly in the snow because the visibility is just too poor. So that's why we put down the old motorcycle. And then we head out. Away we go. Alright, here we are, snow biome. Let's have some fun. Let's start with this place here, shall we? If we haven't done it already. Ooh, noises. Ooh, quality six wrench, hello. I can hear zombies, I just can't see them. Ooh. It's a green girl. Oh, biker. All right, slugs. And now I'm down here. <laughs> Let's see what they were protecting. Nothing. Nothing. Don't tell me there's nothing to this house now, after all of that. Big old garden. Anything in here? Just a little rotten bag. Okay, well that place is done. These cabins definitely fit this biome, don't they? Oh, hang on. Got this dude again. Looking forward to his new texture. Alright, we're trapped in here now with these guys. Ooh, get out of my way, cowboy. No fair, he had a cowboy protecting him. I want a cowboy protecting me at all times. Right, come on. This weird hallway. Oh, Edgar. I feel like it's a while since we've seen old Edgar boy. The normal version, anyway. Just give me my loot. Sounds like we've got another lumberjack friend up there. Look at those quality six steel knuckles. Uh, beautiful. Let me out, let me out. I think there's a lumberjack in here somewhere. Ooh, no, he's not here. Good thing I didn't panic, eh? <laughs> Alright, this place is done. It's nice to be in a different biome. I don't come to this biome often enough. So many of this dude. Eat that. And we have another little place to explore across the street here. Uh, let's check some stuff in the bike quickly. That's better. In through the window. And away we go. Oh, hello ladies. Oh. That's a rough landing. I think you may have a twisted ankle, sir. Go and get it checked out. Ooh, that's a lot of noise. You put the boom boom. Come on, skater boy, get out of there. Wow, look at this loot I'm getting. Some very nice loot indeed. This is why it's worth going around all these POIs, you see. Mark that's done. Let's carry on on our merry little way. And what do you think this is right here? Oh, is this place we did this like last episode? There's nothing in it. Borderline pointless. Hello. Feral Edgar. Oh, what a surprise. 
So biker boy. Ooh, 18 repair kits. We'll have a bit of that. Yeah, game stage 175 seems to be roughly when you get tons of bikers everywhere. Ooh, I hear another stupid lumberjack. Where are you? Just improving his looks there by blowing his face off. And how does one get into this little place? Oh, was this my place? Yeah, this is the, the same POI that I uh, lived at at the beginning of the series. Let's crouch into here. Ooh, a lovely bit of cement. Oh, what a surprise. Ooh, nice. Uh, mine's better, but still, decent find. Get out of here, double denim. And you as well. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Wow. So many bikers. They just feel so much harder to hit than most zombies as well. Alright, there's more biker bikery goodness for us. I think that uh, biker behind is feral. Sure is. Have a bit of that, son. Well, another biker? Come on now, this is too many. Whoa, whoa. What is going on with this place? Now I can hear dogs. Okay, well, I guess let's try and get upstairs. No, this is where we were. Okay. Come on. Well, I think I found the way down. There's the dog. Surprise, surprise, it's another biker. And here's the end stash. Beautiful stuff. I'll take a bit of that action. And a bit of that action. Take all of that action. I'll stop saying action now. Apart from when I say action just now to say I'll take this action as well. Excellent. Uh, let's just check these things on here. There we go. 3,400 that helmet will sell for. Look at that. I don't feel like doing Dog Snake Pigman. We've done that place so many times this series. Getting a little bit tiresome doing that place now. What else does this town hold for us? Oh, look, it's got a little torch here. Oh. Wow, look at the snow down here. That's cool. That's the first non glowy cowboy we've had for a while. I feel like it's been ages since I've done this place. Hey! Whoa! Here, man. Okay, I'm trying to get the soldier with the slug, because the slug is what will kill him. There we go. But yeah, those other numpties jumping in front of him. Ooh, I spy some early loot here. Oh, ho, ho, very nice. Oh, even better. And that's sensational. We love a bit of that. Oh, hello, Thumb Man. I win the Thumb War. Hey! Come on, soldier boy. See you later, chump. Oh, wow. Craft basic resources like ore, stone, wood, and some more compact stacks that are easy to carry. Oh, that's a beautiful sound. We've completed the Art of Mining book series. That's a huge one. I knew I liked this POI for a reason. Ooh. Wow, it's great. Come into these ones that you don't do so often. If you get surprised like that. Ooh, I just heard a landmine go off. Get out of here, Thumb Man. Take a nap, son. There he is, look. Look at him jiggle. <laughs> and here's my end stash. Wonderful. Work and workbench. Uh, my axe is better than that. Take all of that. Ooh, quality six club, hello. That'll sell. Ooh, quality six hammer will also sell. It'll all sell, let's face it. Look at that desert vulture. Uh, so let's throw some things on here. That can go in there, and that can go in there. Ooh, I can hear a mountain lion. That's exciting. Look at all this good loot we got just from this place. It's crazy. Let's drop down the side here. 
parkour skill. Doing us a favour there. Okay, well, there's a guy up there. I want to know where this mountain lion is. Let's drop down. We can't have it making all this noise and not take it on, surely. Ooh! Where'd this radiated come from? Oh, I, he I hear you. I hear you, kitty catty. Oh, soldier. Got to get my shotgun back out. Not allowed to use a machete. There we go. And we're free. Oh, just remember. That place with this little torch outside is a great little POI. Now, I don't think this place will have much loot, but I think it'll have a ton of zombies. Certainly would appear so. Excellent. Ooh, bit of ammo. Can't say no to a bit of ammo. Look at that, it's only half past three. Got all this loot. Still got some room as well, that's a scary thing. Hey, Graham. Ooh, hey, Thumb Man. That's T H U M B. Thumb Man. I can see you radiate your cheerleader. Ooh, and a biker. <laughs> Excellent. Uh, I'll take that and check then. Thank you very much. Don't think there's much loot to this place as such. Oh, there's a passing gas box up there though. A lot of effort for not much loot really, that place. There's a lot of spawns for where it is. Mark that. And mark that. Okay, we can probably fit one more place in. Get out of it. Oh wow, there's a trader down here we didn't know about. That's crazy. We hadn't uncovered this little corner of the town and we didn't know about this trader. Looks like it's Trader Hugh again. <laughs> That's another one for the map. So many traders. So there's a Hugh here and a Hugh here. Hello, Balance. Well, hello, Hugh. If you see a meat stew, buy it. Find us eaters, eh, Mike? Bit of cement. We'll take that cripple and mud. Decent. I guess you're not so bad after all. And this is great news because I get to call him Trader Hugh 2. Congratulations, you're now Hugh 2. I guess that means we wouldn't have done this place here, so we'll just do this quickly, I think, and then end off, head home. Let's just quickly eat them and modify that. That's enough room for some decent loot. Hello! I hear footsteps. Of course it's you. Ooh, quality 6 pick in there. We need a second quality 6 auto shotgun. Oh, look at that jump. Oh, look at that. <laughs> hey, uh, yeah, hidden stash there, if you didn't know. Yeah, we need a quality 6 auto shotgun, so we have a second one, a quality 6 auger, and a quality 6 impact driver. That's the last of the loot I want and need. The rest of it's just for selling, to be honest. Hello, crawly bobs. Come on now. All right, nothing else going on down here, it would seem. So we must have to go upstairs. Where, of course, is a biker. Just pop that head. Ooh. Well, hello, Graham. Right through and up and over and round. I don't know where to go. Drop this here. Okay, so that's where you'd get that hidden stash, I see. I guess we go in this way, do we? Yes, we do. Ow. Let's just make sure we're loaded here. Oh, bikers, man. Kite a little bit. Okay, and now you. Jobs are good'un. Right, let's go around the room here. Don't want that. I'll take all of that. I'll take them. I'll take that. I will read and scrap and take, 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 take. Well, and now we're full, so that's perfect timing for us to go and hit the road. Get out of here! Alright, let's pick up the motorcycle. Let's get in here and let's fly our way home. Just realised I'm in the snow and I shouldn't be flying, but it'll be okay. It won't take as long to get out of it. This is what I mean, by the way, when I say you can't see anything in the snow biome. I'm not lying. 
And just like that, we can see again. Ooh, look at this orange smoke. Do we stop and get it? Well, I think we should. It's not often we see these out in the wild. There we go. Let's refuel that. And check out what this airdrop has to offer. Ooh, motorcycle chassis. I mean, I don't care about these cans. At all. The rest of that's kind of useful, I guess. I mean, we don't need any more match supplies. But the thought's nice. Okay, Boom HQ should be around this corner somewhere. Here we go. Perfect. Grab some stuff. And let's get sorted. Alright, sorted, sorted, sorted. We've got some building to do. Let's grab this, this, this. Just grab a bunch of random crap here. More cement. Grab those fence posts as well there. You know, it could be good. Have we got any dart drops? Yes, we have. Dart drops could be useful, maybe. In fact, I'm calling it now. 600 darts there. 600 darts there. Just do it. All right, over to this thing. We need a way up here. Just temporary-like. We also need to upgrade these to iron. Right, is that going to hurt pathing if we put that block there? Oh yeah, maybe it will. Let's get rid of it. That's okay there. Okay. Before we get too crazy with all of this, let's get a generator bank down, but let's get it a bit higher up here. So it's got a stretch between these two areas. But here's probably a good spot for it. We want to go from this to that. And from that. Wait, is that wired? Let's find out. Oh yeah, that's using... 10 watts of power. Yeah, 5 watts each. Perfect. We also want to go from here to here, here, to here. Reason being that if I'm clever about this, I can leave a gap here. Uh, let's try it there. We should be able to repair that if need be. All right, so dart drop, I hear you say. Well, good news, the fence posts work. Let's maybe turn them off, eh? <laughs> well, obviously, the uh, dart traps need to go over here. Okay, so the fence post sits there, so we can't put one at the bottom. That's fine. We need some cobble. That's what we need. Maybe I've got some over here. Sure have. Well, we've even got some steel. That's good to know. Make me a couple of flagstone blocks there, will you, buddy? Let's put them there. We will stick a dart trap just here. I want to wire that thing up. Actually, do we want that on a switch? Yes, we do. Did I bring switches? No, I didn't. All right, let me go get a switch. Give me those switches. We probably want a switch here. Going from this to this and this down to this. Yeah, that works. Let's make sure it's got plenty of engines. So this is running 31 watts of power with the switch on and 21 with it off. Perfect. And I would like to be able to clear them out with um, another dart trap here, maybe. That could work. Let's try that. Which will mean doing this here. Get this there. Yeah, that'll be nice and head height with them. we get a nice arrow slit over that as well. Cool. And then we need to go from this to this and this to that. Perfect. Get 41 water power now. Good stuff. So now the plan would be they come here, they get trapped in a shock, I can shoot down, if demos appear we can hit the switch, they can dart traps from this way, dart traps from this way, I don't believe the dart traps trigger them, so that's grand. Uh, perfect, let's just spend the rest of this time getting this up to concrete. Mm, I don't like the way this is exposed, but what we could do, get a plate over that there, even better might be a hatch actually. Perfect, then we can access our fence post there if need be. Then we might stick an arrow slit here. Stick that there. Let's just see now. Yeah, we can repair that from here. Perfect. And there's the morning bell. So a bit more progress in here. We've got a plan now. We just need to figure a way to, to build this up. Make sure they haven't got any ways across and stuff. But that's for next time because we have run out of time with our egg hype house this time. Thank you so much for watching, I really hope you're enjoying yourself. If you are, let me know by leaving a like down below. And if you do want to see daily content on this channel, why not subscribe today? Thank you so much, have a good one, and I will catch you in the next one. Bye bye.